Hey everyone, today I'm here with Christy and she was going to tell you a little bit about her experience with the one-on-one -on -one coaching. So Christy, I was just going to ask you, tell everyone a little bit about like where your mindset was or how you were feeling before you started the coaching program um, and kind of give us a little insight into what made you even want to start. Um. So honestly, I think I I was really lost because I had tried so many different things, um, so many different diets. Keto was one of them. Um, I had also, you know, been looking for quick fixes, you know, um, can't remember some of the names of the programs that I had tried before, but basically they were all things that were not sustainable for me. Um, I couldn't eat the foods that I loved. I, um, I, I, was basically eating chicken and vegetables all the time. And that was not something that I could stick with because I don't love chicken and vegetables. Um, but yeah, I was just, I was lost and I really wasn't sure what to do or where to go from there. I had no idea that I could still eat the foods that I like to eat and lose weight. Um, I didn't know that until I started your program, um, but I felt, yeah, I just, I just felt really lost. And I think that I had a very bad relationship with food because I could stick to maybe eating the chicken and the vegetables for maybe two to three weeks. And then after that, it was like, okay, I can't do this anymore. And then I would just go all out, which kind of led to binge eating for me because then pizza is one of the foods that I absolutely love to eat. And my family would, you know, order pizza like every Friday. So when, uh, when they would order pizza, I was just like overindulging in pizza because I hadn't had it. And I'm like, I don't know when next time is I'm going to be able to eat pizza again. So I would just eat so much of it. And then I felt guilty and I felt shame and I felt like I was a failure because I wasn't sticking to this plan that at the time I didn't realize it just wasn't sustainable at all. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I totally relate to all of that too. So what was your experience like in the program going from feeling like you had to eat chicken and veggies <laughs> to whatever? Like what all did you get to eat on the program? Um, I honestly, I got to eat whatever I wanted. Um, I remember talking to you one time too about my coffee. Like I just, I cannot do the sugar-free thing. Um, I have to have sugar in my coffee. <laughs> uh -huh. Um. And you were like, that's fine. You can have the sugar in your coffee. It's okay. Like there's nothing that's bad, you know, mm -hmm. um, it's just kind of everything, you know, in moderation or, you know, you have to have some sort of balance there, but I definitely feel like my relationship with food has improved because I no longer look at anything as being bad or off limits. Um, so I'm not binge eating anymore. I know that when we order pizza, I can have pizza. Mm -hmm. Um, and I know that, you know, I can eat it whenever I want. So I'm not, overindulging in it, I can have a couple of pieces and feel satisfied. Good. Yes. That is the ultimate goal. Like the food freedom, you know, yeah. just, and for life, like you will never will worry about food again. Of course, there's going to be different things that you implement for whatever goals that you have, but yeah, ultimately you can eat whatever you want. Yeah. Um, so what would you say to someone who's kind of like on the fence about joining the coaching program and what would you say if it was like one of your girlfriends that just was curious, but kind of scared to do it? Um, I would let her know that this program has honestly changed my life. Um, for me, it was definitely more than just, you know, a weight transformation or losing weight or anything like that. Um, it changed my mindset around food. And I would say just, just do it. I mean, um, what, what have you got to lose? You know, um, it has helped me in more ways than just, like I said, just, you know, losing weight. Um, it's helped me with my, the way I view the scale. Um, 
you know, seeing that number on the scale used to be extremely frustrating for me. Or sometimes I felt like I really wasn't making um, progress like I should be making. But then you would point out, you know, all the ways that I have been making Mm -hmm. progress. And it was um, it was definitely life changing. So I would I would say just do it. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for sharing your experience. And I can't wait to see how you do even in the future with everything that you've learned. Thank you. So good.